fortunate in terms of weather never leaves me, and this time was no exception. It's raining and there's a pleasant cold breeze in the north to complete the picture. However, we do not lose in small talk and then later, if weather conditions improve we will address the topic better. I want to introduce you the new electric inflator distributed by Imperial Fishing, essential accessory to inflate at the best and in a very, very comfortable RI boat. To start it is a product very light and studied in the details, but we will see better later, because now, with these weather conditions we cannot dwell over. As I told you the inflator works electrically so it will need to feed it to 12 volts. We can connect it directly to our car battery or use a laptop battery, as I am doing now. Inside we will find a comfortable cord with clamps for connecting the inflator to a battery. The greater comfort in using this inflator to inflate the floor of our rubber boats because, being under a high pressure the will be inflated to a 0.60 bar. Already the tubular will be inflated with a pressure of 0.25 bar which, all things considered with the pump with a dual action even if with difficulty, it is possible to achieve. Inflate but optimally to the floor to 0.60 bar with the hand pump, although dual action, it will not be easy, however, with this electric inflator will be a breeze. I set the electric inflator to 0.60 bar, we turn on it and we see what happens. Let's see what happens with my 90 kilograms above. I feel relieved in the true sense of the word, it is really a wonderful feeling, it seems to be back a featherweight, inflator even under stress is not affected of nothing, as if above the floor there was nothing, and I feel also the floor that stiffens in an incredible way, it would be almost impossible to achieve with a hand pump these pressure, the sensation is like walking on granite so stiffened the floor, really amazing, of this, those who will most benefit without doubt will be your back but, in this case my back, set to the correct pressure, once the inflator will have reached it will stop automatically, and voila you're done, without making the slightest effort, truly exceptional, a product absolutely recommended. Well what about Stephen? If he resisted our tonnage, he can resist something. It has been a tough test for him, for us absolutely not certainly but, it was a real pleasure. But now we have to go fishing, so we find all the equipment on our eye boat, and we reach our position before it gets back to rain. Have you already seen the inflator in action and, as I always repeat the images are more comprehensive than a thousand words, then you realized very well what this product is capable. 
However, it is worth seeing good technical characteristics so that we understand why this inflator guarantee us an absolute reliability. Let's see what are those characteristics. Let's start by saying that the inflator is contained within this beautiful and practical waterproof bag. This will ensure us that we always have our product protected from dust, rain or mud, elements that are certainly not lacking in our fishing sessions. In the rear part of the housing we have access, by a convenient zip, to a compartment, in which are comfortably content, the tube to inflate our eye boat, or whatever else we have at pneumatic very durable and long about a meter and a half, then used in a very comfortable way at every opportunity. I already equipped the tube with the attack required to inflate the eye boat but, in series, have provided many other attacks that allow us to connect the inflator to any type of valve present on the market. Still in the same compartment located place the cable required for the power supply of the inflator. This too is very long tool we are about 3 meters, then we will be able to perform all operations in a very comfortable way. Even if we have to connect the cable to the car battery, its length will allow us to always have enough room to maneuver. At the end of the cable, there are two tweezers, aesthetically very nice and very very sturdy. The all, it is contained within this second compartment in a very orderly way and safe from any kind of dirt or moisture. On the front side conveniently we will have access to the inflator by an opening with velcro. Here it is, this is the inflator, as you can see very compact and light. We are about 2 kilograms of weight, and it is distributed by Imperial Fishing and built by Parson, a noble company especially for the production of algeboard motors and other things dedicated to boating. To operate the inflator, what we will have to do, is press this little button black pond. We have always led on the front panel that if solid red, it will report us that the inflator is connected, and it will be flashed color when the inflator will operate. Also on the front panel we find the dial to set the tire pressure or, for example, we know that the separate rooms of our eye boat are inflated to a pressure of 0.25 bar. What we will have to do is adjust the dial to 0.25 bar and, once the inflator has reached this pressure, it will stop automatically. Nothing could be simpler and and will be sure to have our eye boat inflated to the pressure recommended by the manufacturer. To inflate with hand pump separate rooms of our dinghy, the floor and the keel is not an easy task, but, with this inflator in a few seconds we will have our eye boat ready to use without making the slightest effort. What I am showing you at this time is the output to which will be connected to the tube which later will be connected to the valves of our eye boat. Simply the pressure, in this way, the other exit that you see will always serve, instead, to connect the tube which then will be connected to the valve's delay boat. But it will serve to suck the air trapped inside, so it is possible as to storing in a much more easy way our vessel. This is another thing really very convenient. How many times we wondered how they did it, when we receive our new eye boat, bend it and make it fit perfectly in his carry bag. The answer is that to do so using this product and, in the same way you can use it to store, to bend, in a much easier way your eye boat bringing it back perfectly into his bag and making it occupy a little space possible. I point out that all these operations, which are the inflation and deflation of our eye boat, are performed in a few minutes, so with a handful of minutes we will have our eye boat ready to use. Another very interesting feature is located inside the inflator. Well you say, but how do we see it? Simple, because I took the trouble to open the inflator to provide it you. You know I'm very curious, and I also want to show you the operation of these products and how they are made is, to go to find any flaw or value you may have. There are not flaws, as in this case, but only technical details excellently realized. Virtually and soon I will explain you how these devices are used. Inside there is a small fan that once operated the inflator, it begins producing and sending air into the separate chambers of the boat. Once the inflator will detect a higher pressure by having to reach, it will actuate two pistons that will be able to produce significantly more air and with an elevated pressure. Normally, in other products, both the pistons at the rooms, 
The cylinders in which these pistons run at very high speed are made of PVC plastic. In this inflator cylinders are made of steel, so you can figure out that will they be absolutely eternal, indestructible, and this will guarantee us to have a more efficient and durable product. In this way we will save time, effort and precious euros. So as I always say, it is better to buy a good quality product one time and not lose more hands or money. In this case with the electric inflator pass and distributed by Imperial Fishing you go on the safe side and you will have a reliable and durable product during the time.